video um, I am actually making the frosting for the blueberry muffin cupcake bath bomb not exactly sure if I'm gonna stick with that name but that's what the fragrance oil is okay so we have our baking soda next we have our citric acid my bubble additive we have our arrowroot powder. I'm going to mix that in too. I am not using your traditional mixing attachment. Why? Because I think that this one works a lot better than the other one. Alright, so what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be going ahead and pouring in the fragrance oil, but I'm not going to pour it in all at once. I need it to go a little slower. There we go. Alright, so what we have here, it's just like a frosting consistency. Now it's a little loose right now, but trust me when I tell you, it will thicken up. I'm going to scrape the sides. It's really sticky, um, which you kind of want, and I'm just mixing it. But you see, it's gonna stay. And that's kind of what you want. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is I'm going to, I have my cup already. I'm gonna scoop some of this into my piping bag. Sometimes I hit it on the nose where I don't have to kind of um, do any extra with it, but if by chance your bubble frosting is too loose, you can stick it in the refrigerator for a few minutes and it will harden up just enough for you to pipe it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put the rest of the frosting in here and I'm going to make these tops a little bit higher because I have extra and I want to be able to utilize that extra. And it smells like fresh baked blueberry muffins. As a child I wasn't really into blueberries but as I became an adult well, I kind of fell in love with the fragrance. Like, I'll go to Starbucks and get me 
blueberry scone whenever they have them. Um, and the fragrance oil that I use, you guys, is from Rustic Essentials. It's their blueberry muffin fragrance, and it smells awesome. Um, that's what I used for the... Um, For the frosting but I use the uh, blueberry jam from wholesale supplies plus for the actual bath bomb um, the actual bath bomb so yay some of my piping is wonky I know that's fine um, I have to admit I did want the frosting to be a little bit stiffer so next time I will make sure that it is um, stiffer so I'm going to just go around this base because I really I want it to really look like a yummy And they smell so freaking yummy. I want to eat them. I definitely am going to have to put that do not eat <laughs> sign on the cupcake because, I, yeah, um, I don't want someone's child to pick it up and try to put it in their mouth. That would not be good. All right, um, let me use the smallest ones. Uh, these are not your traditional soap balls, as you can tell. I use a, um, a ice cube tray mold, and it just so happens to be kind of sort of like a ball mold, so I went with it. Um, is just how I like to do them. And should I put glitter on them? Miss Jacqueline? No. No glitter on these. 
She says no glitter, you guys. Wow. Okay. So, that's a surprise. I do have these little styrofoam cups. So, with my extra, I'm going to go ahead and pipe it in there. Yes, my daughter, she loves when there are extras because she, oh, I'm done now. Okay, she wants to pipe. I told her I will <laughs> let her pipe next time because I still have to do my raspberry champagne um, bath bomb cupcakes. So what I'm going to do, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and I am going to put these in the refrigerator for about five to 10 minutes. Let the frosting get super duper hard and I'm gonna go ahead and package these bad boys up and stick a label on them and put it on the website. So, if you like the video, you guys, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome. Thank you for watching me and look forward to many, 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 many other videos from Lather and More. Till next time you guys. Bye. All right, you guys, we are back and the bath bomb cupcakes have finished. So, there we go. Going to go ahead and pick one up. Yeah. Oh, I'll pick a pretty one up. A very, very pretty one. Alright, so these are, oh, uh, it, it doesn't want to really focus, but you can see it, really, you suck, camera. Um, it's still auto-focusing, I don't know why. But if I hold it still, maybe it'll focus. All right. Um, there you have it. I think I'm going to call these Blissful Blueberry Bath Bomb Cupcakes. They smell amazing. And as you can see, that frosting is super hard. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and package these bad boys up stick a beautiful label on it and be done catch you guys later bye